Greetings all, Shane Bruce, Rest of Daisy. Decided to uh, take some snaps and shoot a video of this particular gun before I ship it back to the customer. It's the first of the 1894s that I've equipped with fiddleback stocks that I'm almost satisfied with. It's a unique look for the gun, but they are the devil himself to manufacture. Daisy, in its wisdom, has decided to there's a box section right underneath the tangs that is, oh, five to eight thousandths of an inch wider than the tangs themselves. And this causes you to have to really take a lot of care when you're inletting to avoid getting a tear out on the tang, something I have not been able to accomplish as of yet. So you can see that unattractive seam there. It doesn't ruin the total look from five feet, but and if you want to get close up with a microscope, it's hard to be happy. But otherwise, the gun is spectacular. I think the, uh, the wood stocks do what they're supposed to and really set it off. Well, that's it for the uh, left side of the gun. We'll do another video in a bit on the right.